She was green. That was interesting. No one's home. Weird. Wonder if they're home. <gasps> Bumblebee for same. You know, when I went to England, um, my friend Millie, I stayed with my friend Millie, and uh, we're on the first floor. Um, she forced me to learn how to roll my own. Oh. Okay, I did something wrong. Shit. She did, because she was rolling them for me, and I didn't have a piece there. Like, I was on the other side of the country, you know? And so, um, she was like, I'll roll a couple for you, but you have to watch, and then you're gonna roll your own. So in order to smoke weed, I had to roll my own. But now I'm really good, so thanks, Millie. <laughs> Did I just go back? Sure did. Buy a roll machine even there? Yeah. Maybe next time. All right, it's not this door. Do you guys hear it get rumbly? It's locked. Same Vissy, like I had to. It was a it was a sink or swim situation, but I got pretty good at it. Every once in a while I hear like weird deep noises and I feel like touching something or I feel like touching something. Cause when I think about it, I touch my elf. Ooh. Please stop touching me, Miss Katie. Shut the fuck up. <clears throat> we already talked to that lovely individual. This is my apartment. Let's see if we missed anything. It's gotta be a, oh, a key card. Catherine Fox, when I think about things. <laughs> okay, nothing, just a sleep aid. Dad doesn't sleep well in a poopy toilet. They definitely need to bleach. Takes two seconds, my dudes. Bleach your toilet, gross. Pussy. When the plague ends. Hearing that Texas, did you hear that this morning, Trin? I don't know, everybody knew it except me, apparently. Texas and Florida are just like, no more masks, they don't care anymore. Opening everything, 100%, like. <gasps> it's daddy. I don't remember his voice, what did I do? This one? This one? This one. This one. Hey, kiddo. Oh. All right. Nothing. There was a time before this. I don't remember it, honestly. Like, I don't hate being home all the time. I'm actually quite the homebody. What bothers me is that I can't go travel and shit. And that people are dying because, you know, my freedoms. Right, we need to have an intervention or just like be like, okay, you two are just your own country now. Enjoy it. Like, do your thing. We're no longer responsible and we're not taking credit for your you anymore. No offense to all my friends in those states. Like, get the fuck out if you'd like. Mississippi is too. Damn. I've heard, um, uh, what's it called? Um, oh, stuff. Oh, I need batteries. Sick. Um, forgot what I was saying. It's gone now. Damn it. Oh, Vissy, that is like sad. Oh shit. Did we talk to her? Did we do any of these? I don't think so. Is this building haunted? So, sweetie, I've been taking care of Addison Apartments for a long time, and I've never seen any ghosts or goblins. That's just people's overactive imaginations. Do 
too much sweets and scary movies, if you ask me. Actually, I don't just work here. I live here too. I'm on call 24-7. For any urgent maintenance needs. Despite what you may hear from others, it's a lovely building. I'm happy to call it home going on 10 years now. It seems like a nice place. You betcha. Oh, all kinds of stuff, I'm sure. This building is well over a hundred years old, you know. People are always complaining about one thing or another. But you'll hear no complaints from me! I'm a woman of action. If I see a problem, I'll fix it. Yeah, most people do seem to complain a lot about small things. You can't sweat the small stuff, Sal. There's no way to live, you know? You're right. So Take it from me. You focus on the good stuff. Focus on what makes you happy in this life. Put your energy into that. She scares me. So, <clears throat> you excuse me. Today. Yes, I did. Oh my god, take you your joy. Forget to take your joy. Don't forget. And I guarantee your day will go as I'm smooth hooked. as I'm hooked. I got a feeling. Bam, 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 bam. I'm high on believing that you're gonna kill me. Oh, whoa. Anyways. So, do you know anything about what happened in 403? It's a shame you and your dad had this crummy first impression. I promise things aren't typically gruesome around here. Poor oh, Mrs. Sanderson. Who, who's Mrs. Sanderson? Oh, never mind that. Let's not set your mind on such dreadful things. So, uh, is there anything fun to do around here? You know what? I have a son about your age. I think you two would get along great. He's downstairs in our apartment. You should go introduce yourself. Sure, I'll go say hi. Great! His name is Larry. He'll be in the basement. Tell him I sent you down. You'll need a key card to access it from here. With the elevator, though. Here, take this one. I've got extras. Cool, thanks. Does that mean she can go anywhere, anytime, and she just has, like, keys everywhere? That's creepy. See you around. <laughs> no one's home. <laughs> Alright, down to the... Is Sparta! Die, motherfucker! Embry, how the fuck has it been a year? Like, at the same time, I feel like I've known you for way more than a year, but also, like, what? Hail the dank lord, motherfuckers. What the fuck? Oh my god, if you- I think it's just- uh, Um, Ashley, if you do exclamation point pronouns in the chat, it should just pull it up. I think. <laughs> right? <laughs> Thank you for the follow. <gasps> Boom, there you go. Yeah, and so you have to go to both those sites. So one of them is um, like the add-on for Twitch chat, and then one of them is literally the site to change your pronouns. Yeah, so you can be a they or a whatever. Whatever you want. And we respect them here. We're in the basement. Oh, repost. <gasps> then I found Kyler while going through a bad depression of him moving back to Ohio to move in with a woman. And he goes to the fuck out of me. I was in a dark place. Ooh, I weighed all of 90 pounds. I remember you told me about your thin times. Then I found my person and he helped put me back together. Oh, I'm gonna cry. 
That's so pr I. You're so lucky, Vissy. I hope everyone finds other Kyler. <gasps> Gee, I sure am looking forward to using this. No. All right. Bright lights. Pesticide. Pretty paint. Tools and junk. Lost and found. I can read. And there's the exact truth. Same. Lots of tasty junk food. I'm not really hungry, though. Guess you needed the link. They're almost done setting up their phone. They just followed you. <gasps> Jesse, are you Omax? If that's Jesse or not, Omax, welcome to my channel. <laughs> uh oh, and there's Zach. Yes. And now, I mean, even if it's not another person like that, the the happiness, you know. <gasps> Cute! Look at the pictures on the wall! Aww! Ew. Clean up your fucking table, you fucking nasties. <gasps> Bathroom. Jesse, welcome to my channel, love. <gasps> it's locked. Yeah. Uh, Larry, your mom said I should come say hi. I just moved into 402. Oh, hey. C come on in, I suppose. Doors open. Hello, Jesse. <clears throat> because you are already one of our own via association. Welcome to my channel. Welcome to my stream. My name's Classic Idiots. Fuck fabulous to meet you. Take my breath away with your choice from my fucked up family today. Welcome to the classiest place under the I invite you and your family to take your pants off, place your hand upon your genitals, and enjoy your time here. I don't stream pants on the front, invite you to do the same. Brace your goddamn nudity, mother fluffers. She still got it. Welcome to my channel, Jesse. <laughs> Oh, here we are. Whoa, nice mask. It's a prosthetic. Oh, she. Sorry, ma'am. It's cool. I'm used to must works by now. I'm glad you like it. So, uh, do you have, like, friends? Oh, do you, oh no, excuse me, do you like, have no face under there? What happened? I'd rather not talk about it. Okay, change the subject. <clears throat> I'm, I'm Larry. I live down here with my mum. I'm Sal. My friends call me Sally Face. I just moved here with my dad from New Jersey. S Sally Face? I guess I didn't really have any decent friends, to be honest. So, once they started calling me that, I figured if I owned the name, the assholes couldn't use it against me. You're a complicated dude, aren't you, Sal? You're, you're like, pretty strange. I like you. We're, we're gonna get along great. Ha. <sighs> That's what your mum said, too. Mother knows best. <laughs> so, 
So, why do you live in the basement? My mum always says it's because we gotta guard the place from rats. But I'm pretty sure she gets this room for free. With the maintenance gig. It's cool though, I don't mind it. I get to listen to music as loud as I want. When she's not round. Nice. Yeah, it's like my own little bat cave. <laughs> I like your shirt. Thanks. Stands for, uh, Sally Face. <laughs> I do have my own clothing line, so... <laughs> it's actually for this metal band called Sanity's Fall. Do you like metal? I don't know. Oh. oh that's called a change. Check out this song. It's their first single. The full album comes out in a few months. And he soon discovers just why they're called spinners. <laughs> the timing! Thank you so much for gifting a sub to one of my new best friends, Keto Jesse. Keto Jesse, you're some motherfucking buh wizard, baby. Go forth and be consensual because nothing is more important than consensuality. That was incredible timing. <laughs> gonna puke. Oh, sick. I can't. I can't make the burp come up. Okay, hold on. Let's do the back app. There we go. A wig. She had to have straight. It wasn't girl next door enough. Her baby fro. Like, just go into my selfie section of Discord and check out Vissy, like, not in a creepy way. She's very, very adorable in every way. Like, there's no fucking way she needed a goddamn wig. Ooh, he drew the evil dog. <gasps> I like your paintings. Thanks, dude. It's my passion. It's insanely racist. That's what I said. Her hair is like, it's one thing. I mean, if you're working in food, like, I don't know if her wig was, if her fro was like out to here and touching people, like maybe get your hair under control because it's unsanitary and it's touching people. But like, no, in no fucking way. She has like an adorable baby fro and she is gorgeous. And she is like, what's the word I'm looking for? Like hygienic, you know, it's not like she looks like a mess. Like for fuck's sake, it grossed me out when she told me that I was like, what? Right? Jessie, she's beautiful and her hair is fucking adorable. Can you, aff I just can't fathom. I mean, no. <laughs> I've been told to put my hair up for food service, but forced to wear a wig because you don't look girl next door enough? I'm sorry, no. Ass turds, yeah. Should I talk to him again? I don't remember. Yes, okay. So, uh, what happened in 403? Shh. 
not so loud, man. What? What is it? The killer is still in the building. How do you know that? I saw it happen. Uh, are you high right now? I wish I was, man. Some scary shit. What happened? Okay, so... I was helping Mrs. Sanderson with clogged toilet, you know? I was just finishing up when I heard him burst in, yelling like a lunatic. I know what you've done. Herman told me everything, you stupid bitch. She tried to calm him down, but before she could get even a few words out, he was cutting her throat wide open. I was shocked. I couldn't move. I was frozen in my fear, man. Speaking through the crack in the bathroom door. Anyways, it all happened so fast, and then he cleaned up quickly and left. I didn't know how, but he didn't even see me. I haven't really told anyone yet, not even me or mum. But I trust you. Really? Do you know who did it? Yeah, uh, it was definitely Charlie, the big creeper from 204. He was wearing gloves, so I don't think they got any prints on anything. I think that's the guy that collects ponies. Shouldn't you tell the cops? I actually tried talking to the detective, but he won't listen to me without some kind of evidence, like my word isn't enough. <laughs> What's up with that guy in 103? That's Mr. Addison. He owns this place. I don't think I've ever seen him leave this room. Always talks through his little mail slot. He's a nice dude, just real strange. Oh yeah, if you say Addison tea, please and thank you to him, he'll give up a cup of his famous tea. I hate the stuff myself, but the adults seem to love it. I bet it's like crack or something poisonous. Radio. What's this thing? That's a, it's a police scanner. I can listen to it in the local cop chatter. How in the hell did you get this thing? That's a story for another day. But hey, you just gave me a great idea. If I make a fake call, maybe I can distract them long enough for you to sneak into 403. Maybe we can find some kind of evidence to show the detectives something they weren't looking for. Or we could fuck. Pretty quick sign for me. Pretty quick to sign me up for the break-in, aren't you? Well, I gotta make the call down here and... I'm just messing with ya. I'm totally up for this. Been wanting to peek in that room anyways. Sweet. So what's the plan? I'll call in a bank robbery, hostage situation, that should clear out the cops for sure. I'm guessing they'll be, they'll, that'll buy us a few minutes till they figure out it wasn't real. You gotta be upstairs when I do that so we can make these minutes count. We can use my walkie talkies to communicate during the whole thing. Then I can give you a heads up too once I know the cops are coming back. Sounds pretty solid to me. Maybe just switch the bank robbery with armed robbery, like, like a gas station or drugstore. Make it a little more believable. Hmm, mm, yeah, I guess you're right. Good call, Sally. Here, take this. Head up to my, your room and let me know when you're ready. Just press that Y button when you're ready to call me. I forgot what room I'm supposed to go, like, look in. Um, 403? I'm in 402. It's gotta be 403. I think. Yeah, 403. Okay. That's what I thought. I just... I'm bad with numbers. Uh, so we want to go back to our room? Or wait, should we go get the tea? We should get the tea first. Let's get this fucking drug tea that the adults love.
Oh, Viata. I forgot what voice I gave him. Uh. This one? I don't remember. Hello, young sir. New resident of Addison Apartments, room 402. How may I be of service? Uh, <clears throat> Addison Tea, please, and thank you. Oh, yes, coming right up. Hi, Glam. <laughs> there you are, sir. Please enjoy. All right, we got it. Uh, Glam, hello, how are you? Mind soldier. Hi, honey. How are you? Um, so I gotta go to my room, yeah. And then walkie ducky somehow. I heard running water. Am I hearing running water or am I crazy? Don't answer that question. Daddy, oh. At least he's trying now. Not drowning himself in booze, not totally giving up on life. On me. Hey, a quarter, score. Sick, later dad. Uh, Gizmo the cat is still doing nothing. Okay. We bit tired. Me too. But I, uh, took an edible last night and I think I woke up high. <laughs> How do I get, uh... <gasps> that one. Okay, I got it. Oh, I'm not in my room. Shit. All right, let's do this. I'm gonna make a call. Give me a second. Okay, it's done. I heard a bunch of hustling upstairs, so I don't think it worked. Go see if you can get into 403. All right. You got method in again for when your head hurts? Pfft. I hate waking up like drowsy like that. Like I slept really well, but why did I go in here? The drowse. Oh, it's the window. There's rain. I get it. That's what I hear. I can't stand that. I like to wake up fresh. Like, waking up drowsy because something's, like, left over in your system. Um, let's see. Use the video game. Oh, I will. I've been using it everywhere. We have eight minutes, by the way, until this little battle thing. Oh, Fiat. Oh, my. Okay. Shall we, um, pack a bowl or something? Ugh. Do you really? I wonder, do you like, do they explain to you why, Vizzy? Like, what's that doing to you that makes you tired? Cause I just don't know. <gasps> Kyle, yes, I'm unplugging it. I had a little, I had a little plug. Cheers. Is it? Is it like your body recovering from that? See, I don't know. <coughs> My scope of practice has nothing at all to do with that. So I don't know. 